hit that subscribe button and the bell icon beside it to check out our latest videos before anyone else. Hi there guys, I'm Nikhil from Greedy Tech and this is the tech news of the day. Google has added a new feature in its search app that will show you all the events happening around you. For example, if you search for events around me, it will help you discover all the events. We can also apply filters like festivals, food festivals, music festivals and so on. Google has partnered with Book My Show All Events, Events High and 10 times for the new search results. Next news is from Amazon. Amazon India is going to allow UPI mode of payment within a month. It has been 6 months since Flipkart has done it with their phone pay app and now Amazon is moving. According to the reports, about 40% of the transactions on Flipkart are done by UPI mode of payment. Next news is from Walmart. Walmart is developing smart cameras to spot unhappy and frustrated shoppers. Based on their latest patent, they are using smart cameras with facial recognition system to monitor customers for signs of anger and dissatisfaction. If they find any unhappy customer, they are going to send their employee to resolve the issue. Because of the competition, instead of going for new customers, Walmart is trying to make the existing customers happy. Next news is once again from Google. Google has launched a new feature to let users explore International Space Station in street view mode on Google Maps. All the images were taken by an astronaut called Thomas in ISS for the past 6 months. Google, Amazon and Facebook are all backing Apple's lawsuit against Qualcomm for overcharging licensing fees for use in their iPhones and iPads. That's one of the reasons why all the brands are forced to use Qualcomm chips in their phones. Airtel says it's losing 550 crores per quarter due to calls from Reliance Geo network. Because of the free calls offer from Geo, Airtel and other telecoms are hit by a flood of calls from Geo network. Every time they get a call from Geo to their network, if there's a call drop, they have to pay fine. That's how Airtel is losing money. When Geo phone releases, losses will be much higher. Next news is once again from Google. Google starts rolling out the new feature, Play Protection, on all the Android devices. Play protection is a feature that automatically scans your phone in the background to check if there are any harmful apps installed on your phone. It checks for all the apps installed from the Play Store and the apps that you have directly installed using the APK files. Next news is from Samsung. Samsung Galaxy C7 2017 edition has got certified. Based on that, we have some specs. Like it has a 5.5 inch Super AMOLED display with a Full HD resolution, unibody metal design with antenna bands on the back a dual camera setup with a 13 megapixel and 5 megapixel camera, a 16 megapixel camera with front facing flash, with a 2850 mAh battery. Just like all the previous Samsung phones, we have a physical home button which also acts as a fingerprint scanner along with touch capacitive buttons. It is running Android 7.1.1 out of the box. Next news is about the Galaxy J7 2017 edition. Samsung Galaxy J7 smartphone has been leaked once again. Nothing much has been revealed except for the dual camera setup on the back. It also has the same old physical home button on the front. A standard version of Galaxy J7 2017 edition has been already launched in South Korea for 23,000 rupees. But this new version might be released in China very soon and it might be released in India too. Next news is from Flipkart. As part of an anniversary celebration, Flipkart officials from the mobile phone department will travel all over the country to meet their first mobile phone buyers and gift them a brand new phone. Next and the final news is about the Reliance Geo phone. Now this phone might come in two variants, one with the Qualcomm Snapdragon 205 processor and another variant with Spectrum SoC. Both the companies have officially confirmed that their chip is going to be on the Geo phone. Qualcomm has already mentioned the name of the processor, while Spectrum hasn't. By the way guys, trailers for Justice League and Thor Ragnarok have been released. Trailer for Avengers Infinity War Part 1 has also been released at a Comic Con and there are some leaked videos on the web. So do check them out if you are interested. So guys that's pretty much it for this video. Thanks for watching. If you like this video hit that like button and subscribe to our channel to see more cool videos on tech. I am Nikhil from Greedy Tech signing off. Have a nice day.